From a big time celeb with a bone to pick with Twitch to a YouTuber who rose to fame as quickly as he might tap out, we've got a double dose of streaming drama on today's SVG News. Drama. <laughs> Corp's husband may be leaving the streaming scene almost as suddenly as he joined it. The deep-voiced Among Us player and musician revealed in one of his recent streams that it's been increasingly difficult for him to keep up with his streaming schedule due to his ongoing battle with a chronic illness, and he's not sure how much longer he will be able to maintain his constant work on the platform. In a segment of his January 2nd stream, the creepy pastor, narrator turned musician turned streamer stated that he soon may not be physically capable of streaming anymore. I don't know about the whole like streamer thing, like with my illnesses. He went on to say that he limits his streams to once or twice a week right now, but those streams will need to get shorter as he manages his illness. All these other people are able to play every day and play different games and stream every day, but I just, I like literally couldn't do that if I wanted to. Corpse also spoke about a recent stream where he was forced to leave early because his nose began to bleed and his whole arm was allegedly numb from sitting in a streaming setup for an extended time period, which is something he typically struggles to do. Later, Corpse claims that his body has been acting up lately and he is working to get back into physical therapy. But at the same time, he is, quote, scared of getting recognized, so he tries to take care of himself. He warned fans that if he seems off in a stream or needs to leave early, it is likely due to something with his illness, and he doesn't want to make it a big deal. Corp's husband is known to be a very mysterious public figure, to the point where he has never shown his face to fans. There is not a single picture of me from before YouTube with my entire face in it. Corp's husband's fans may be disappointed to see him leave the streaming scene, whenever that may be, but he won't be completely out of the public eye. A YouTuber revealed that he plans to focus more on his music career, because that is something he is, quote, physically capable of doing with his illness. Grammy Award-winning musician T-Pain had an amusing rant on Twitch expressing frustration regarding his relatively small audience compared to Twitch's biggest stars. While T-Pain's outburst may come from a place of humor, it does speak truth to the struggles that many new streamers face when trying to grow their audience on Twitch and other streaming platforms. I'm trying to help every part of this bracket. We not in that bracket. T-Pain's comments were inspired by a debate as to whether the artist qualified as a small streamer. After all, T-Pain's channel has been live since 2014, is covered by major news outlets such as Newsweek, and has over 480,000 subscribers. While the barrier to begin streaming is low, Twitch is a notoriously tricky streaming community for new streamers to break into. Some streamers have spent years streaming to few or no viewers without gaining anything near T-Pain's following. However, T-Pain asserts he and other smaller streamers audiences are in an entirely different bracket than Twitch's most popular content producers. The first streamer T-Pain aims at is the always controversial XQC. XQC just did 90,000 on a just chatting and I'm not a small streamer? He then turns his attention to Miss Kiff's recently dormant channel. Miss Kiff ain't been on his stream in 10 days and you going there with a constant 8,000 views. Finally, T-Pain turns his attention to Tim the Tapman, pointing out the streamer's habit of beginning his daily streams on an early schedule. T-Pain grabs his microphone to emphasize as he shouts, Tim the Tapman streams at 7 a.m. in the morning! <laughs> the musician went, or rather yelled on, joking, Tim the Tapman streams before any of us wakes up and he still gets 38,000 people in the first 30 minutes! While a recording of an internationally famous musician like T-Pain ranting about his popularity on Twitch is undoubtedly amusing, it does offer some insight into the difficulties of streaming at every end of the spectrum. The obstacle of gaining momentum and building followers has led streamers to create follow-for-follow -follow groups to try and place the building blocks of a Twitch community. However, on the other side, many new streamers have acknowledged the difficulty of maintaining a regular streaming schedule. Uh, is the drama over? Oh, damn it! Stupid thing is so heavy!